welcome back to Chala Black's YouTube channel. I want to welcome all my subscribers and I want to welcome all my new subscribers. Um, today, today video that we'll be doing today is going to be targeting your abdomen, your stomach, your belly, that area. That's where we're going to target because as you see, it's still winter technically. We, we won't have summer until the 21st of March, but today we have a good day. But again, don't let this weather trick you. If you see the way I dress, I still have on my winter gears, you know. But right now it's good to work outside, work out outside. So today I'm gonna do the video from here. This is gonna be my um, my gym, you know. And for the new person, you know it's Health Over Wealth with Chala Blocks. That's a YouTube channel. And you know, um, health first in everything, right? Okay, so let's get into the video today, as I said. We're gonna be concentrating on your abs because summer is coming for the persons who live in this in the in the cold state like New York. You know, we look forward for summer because it's a four season um, climate state where you can't go to the beach when it's winter, right? So I know everyone is getting their body ready, um, and this is one of the way to do it is with exercise and workout and also detox right and also detox um, do your detox if you check it out check my video prior you will see that I do a green juice for detox all right so as I said today we're gonna be concentrating on your abs your abdomen right okay I mean it's warm I'm gonna take off my uh, my jacket but I'm still gonna keep on my my thumb because what happened is that um, with that being said, my, my, my thing for me to get sick in the winter is when the ear goes into my ear. So I always try to have something on my head, right? So I'm gonna be quickly taking off the jacket, but I'm gonna be still staying in the, in the top. All right? Okay, so first, we're gonna start off, right? We're gonna lay flat on our stomach. I call it the imaginary bicycle because you're literally pretending with your head down the cameraman can come sideways too to show that your head has to be down touching the ground if he comes sideways just to show you the angle you know so now you're gonna be you're gonna be doing the imaginary bicycle because you're not riding a bicycle right but you're gonna pretend that you're riding um, the bicycle right you're gonna and you're riding a bicycle. For this one, you're gonna do three sets. But with, with the set, it's not gonna be like three sets of 10. You're gonna do a minute like this. Stop, maybe 15 seconds, go back, do another minute. Stop, go back and do another minute. Right? Okay. You finish that one, you're also gonna keep in the same position, but this time you're gonna raise your legs. You're gonna raise your feet, go up, go down, go up. This one you can do sets, so you would do like say one, two, three, four. This one you're gonna do three sets at 10 for this one. Um, I hope you're getting the drift also see what I'm trying to show you I try to see I try to make the video short you know but you see the routine that I'm saying so you're gonna do three sets of ten that way now same position also you're on the ground still in the same position a different workout you're gonna do this one also three sets of ten so when you go wide and get back in it's gonna be one two Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm already feeling the burns already. I'm already feeling the burns, right? Okay. So you'll do three sets of ten that way. So now, 
we're gonna be doing some some sit-ups sit-ups crunches whatever you call it we're gonna be doing some sit-ups all right Sit-ups, right, up, when you go up, you go all the way up, right, where your head almost touching your knee, you go back down, you're going to be doing three sets of ten, so three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine ten so those are regular um sit-ups crunches right okay now you're gonna be in the same position this time you're gonna be using your left elbow to go to your right to your right knee and your right elbow going to your left knee what that does is it gives you that v cut right so look one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, when you're doing them, just watch. Make sure your back is touching. Your back has to go all the way down. Don't have your back half. Go all the way down. I'm feeling all that burn here. And you do three sets of ten going across. Alright? No. This is, a, this is a universal workout for both male and female. You know what I mean? To target the abdomen, to target your belly, your stomach. That's, that's, a, a, that's a, um, a universal workout for both male and female, right? Okay, all right. No, try to invest in this. This is very good to have. Alright. So alright. You're gonna be in this position. Hopefully the cameraman can see. You go out back. Alright? on your knee for now for persons who are beginners you could do it this way look you stay on your knee and you go out for now back right for beginners so for beginners stay on your knee let your knee stay on the surface for beginners you go out back right go out and you will do three sets of 10 this way. Now, the harder way to do it, and remember, as I said, do beginners try to use this way so you, you kind of have your balance. It's easier this way when you just start than to do it this way. For the persons who are comfortable, right, with it and know what they're doing, they can do it this way, and this way is harder. Look, so you go out, now you're on your tippy toes, back. That one is definitely, definitely harder, not for beginners. Okay, you go out, look at the position. Back. Right? One more time, demonstrate. This one is harder, not for beginners. You go all the way out. You're on your tippy toes. You see that position? Like you're in a plank position. Back. 
All right. Doc, trust me, I'm feeling it all in this area. All right. So we did some sit-ups, two different types of sit-ups. Um, we do two different type of foot raises going up, imaginary bicycles, and going wide and coming across, right? And now you see I have the wheel. Also, what's good also is, what also good is this thing, the jump rope. But believe it or not, I'm having a hard time doing it. I'm having a hard time using the jump rope. So I'm gonna have to get practice with it. But this is a good way of losing weight, staying, um, keeping you fit. And as I said, I always try to make, the, make my workout equipment as cheap as possible. So I'm trying to have it where there's no excuse for working out. I'm not good at this. But this is this this I shouldn't even attempt it today. So I'm gonna practice first before I come on camera with this. So next time, but I'll be practicing with my jump rope, but I have it. So what I'm what I always finish off with is my planks. Right? Today is all about keeping the tummy in tuck the natural way. The natural way of keeping the, tum the tummy in tuck. So now I'm gonna be doing planks. What is required is two minutes. You don't need to go more than two minutes. You know, to get the best benefit is two minutes. So if you go two minutes, you can stop and then start over for another two minutes. Um, for planks, um, it takes practice because I couldn't do half a minute when I start, which is just 30 seconds. But now I have video where I'm doing almost seven minutes in plank. But to get the real benefit from it, it's two minutes. And then you start back over and do another two minutes. Um, so I know I'm only doing two minutes. But just to demonstrate for the first time viewers and subscribers, when you're doing planks, you gotta be on your elbow and you gotta be on your toe, on your toes. Also, your body should not be touching the surface at all. All right? So this is the position that you're gonna be in. This position, and as you see, look. See, nothing touching. On your tippy toes, on your elbow. Nothing touching, that's the format that you're gonna have. You will have a stop clock on your phone, and you will time yourself for two minutes. You don't have to do two minutes right away. You just have to work your way up to two minutes. But you'll be in this position doing your planks. I normally, it's a good thing to do planks at any, at the end of every workout. Trust me. Because at that time you're tired. So you're actually pushing yourself more. And also putting more pressure on the core to build up. Because you're tired. So if you can do it at that time, then, you know, that's really good. So at the end, I would recommend that you do your planks at the end of your workout. Right, and you'll be doing it for two minutes. Nowhere need to be touched. Right, hold that position. Right, that's regular planks. No, you have the planks also for love handles. Right, but and it's it's just the uh, just the opposite position. Instead of you being laying on your stomach facing, you're gonna be sideways. So this would be the plank. This type of plank would be for love handles. Right, and you'll be like that so you'll do it on this side for a minute right you do it on this side for a minute same thing now we need to be touched right across elbow same way up right and check it out i do have a plank video where i'm doing at least almost i want to say 12 different types of planks so now you change right same thing we hold it here for a minute also that position All right 
and you do that for two minutes and as I said I recommend that you do planks at the end so I hope that you learned something today from today's video um, today I was just targeting abdominals it's spring summer is coming everybody want to look the best for the summer and with detox and the right workout and exercise for your abdomen definitely you can see results before the summer came but you have to be very consistent with what you're doing you can't just do it today and detox tomorrow and then that's it no you have to consistently doing it so i recommend at least detoxing three times for the week with green juice lemon um, ginger turmeric and flushes your system out and then do these um abdominal exercise abs exercise that i just demonstrate right here in this video right um <clears throat> With that being said, I want to thank all my subscribers for subscribing to the channel. Please share the video, like the video, hit the notification bell, leave me a comment, and continue to subscribe. Um, also, I want, to, I want to just emphasize on this also. Make sure that you check with your physician if you have any form of health condition before you do these type of um, workout exercise. Also, keep yourself very, very hydrated. <clears throat> because remember 60% of the of the um, the body is made up of water so you have to make sure that you're drinking a lot of water you know to keep your body going um, again thank you very much for watching and I hope that you like this video I hope that you learn something from this video it's Chala Blocks with health over wealth and I'm out